Young the Restless reveals that Phyllis's game of hide-and-seek is dragged on for too long, and it's time for her to face it in exchange for a life full of freedom. Her fake murder hoax was completely exposed but could not be caught. The police also had enough evidence to charge her, so she shouldn't have escaped from the law. Kyle will give Kyle a chance to confess to herself all the crimes she's committed, so she can soon receive the leniency of the law to reduce her sentence. Kyle Abbott had a perfect opportunity to finish Phyllis's run, but he indulged in his wife's best intentions and let his wrong mother-in-law escape justice. But Diane provoked Phyllis for her revealed murder hoax that revealed itself in Los Angeles, California. Diane is trying to find a way to trap Phyllis to get out of the cave, but Summer always tries to stop Phyllis for fear that her mother will face a life sentence related to Jeremy's murder. Make no mistake, Diane is not responsible for Phyllis's anonymous communication with Jeremy. Red ensures that Jeremy is able to locate Diane, leading to mayhem. That provocation that set Phyllis on the path of revenge continues to this day. Phyllis conspired with Jeremy to fake her death and determined that it appeared to be a crime against the son-in-law's mother. You, Diane. That led to Diane going to jail on a murder charge. Now, whatever defense Phyllis wants, she has to face the court while Jeremy is dead now. Although he died trying to kill Phyllis after she wanted to end their arrangement and return to GC alive. The fact that Phyllis killed Jeremy in self-defense was not witnessed by anyone, not even the audience. All incriminating evidence goes through the medical department's control process. Although Sharon's case was similarly fatal, Chance was present when Cameron Kristen was killed by Sharon Rosales. It was an act of self-defense with many witnesses present. Sharon, if convicted, just wanted to protect her life against Cameron's threat. Phyllis's incident with Jeremy is completely different. Phyllis has no one to testify for her, which makes her guilty of attempted murder. Even if a paid witness could cover the case, she would still need to explain the murder hoax and the fugitives of the past months. The YNR storyline is heating up with legal complications, which Phyllis and Sharon may face. Chance seemed awkward in the face of all this trouble, so Chance will be particularly worried about the reappearance of Ian in the story that conveniently covers up Phyllis's attempt to evade justice on YNR. YNR channel will continue to bring interesting things to the audience. Please subscribe to the channel and update the latest news on YNR channel.